embrace the fact that we could look at the statement, the review done by the other group, and look at it. That's what she just said. So it's taken out of my mouth. I mean, the whole, the whole reason why we actually um, prepared this declaration is because women do not have the legal yeah. at the point yeah. level. So I think that's, therefore, the context is so um, clear, no? I mean, it, it's, it's addressed it is addressed to the community level, not the policy level. But, but, but all the interventions, I'm so sorry, I'm, I, I just want to be clear. All the interventions then, okay. because this is like a preamble, mm -hmm. then we go to what we want to do. All we want to do is policy. Related, because we are talking about, we here declare that, yes. yeah. we declare that, this to government, this to UN bodies, isn't that policy? Yes. yes. It's not yes. community level? No. Yes. Yeah. So then, so, 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 the problem I have with the Excuse me, sir. Can. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Uh, let us look at the Security Council resolution 1395. Even before this resolution came into being, the women always bore the brunt of war in Africa. Mm. They are the ones who are left behind to take care mm. and to take care of communities and families. Mm. The situation here is the same. So if they can, okay. rather than they are. Yeah, right. And I think yeah. there's a big difference. Okay. If we say they can, it means that they have not, they have not done, done it. But they are, but they are doing it. Yes. Okay. Yes. So, let me just yes, clarify. Yes, Anna. Yes, Anna. What we said was that you know, there are two parts of it. Evidence from around the world that women can be powerful leaders. That's the beginning of it. Then the next part is that their leadership in countless situations have directly contributed to the survival. So at the community level, they are contributing. Yes. But then they can be um, leaders and agents of change. I think this one is supposed to... Um, state the facts at the community level, then in, in the recommendations, uh, we, we are looking at this as input to policy change. So if we state what happens at the community level, then we can suggest what needs to go into the policy so that the policy can trickle down to the community to empower the, the woman more. I don't know okay. whether I'm... Okay, I'm getting you. Let's first listen to him. Sorry, uh, one last one. Uh, when you say our problem is uh, well documented, okay, there is evidence, of course, that we, we observe women doing it when there is a sort of strife. But in terms of documentation, the re adequate research, especially in Africa, I don't think we've done enough. And I'm sure that's why, as a recommendation number, I think the second to the last, they're saying we need to accurate Data disaggregated by sex. So when we say uh, well documented, then we block ourselves, and then this other will become irrelevant. So I guess we need to remove. We need to say documented, but the word well. It's may, may I suggest a drastic change here? Supposing we get rid of uh, uh, the well documented evidence from around the world that women are powerful leaders and agents of change and we say underscoring um, evidence that women women i want to get rid of the first of this one of uh, of leaders and agents of change and then pick their leadership in countless disaster situations has directly contributed to the, to the survival of communities you get what i mean if we go to read of the first part in our case because when we take it there the other groups might bring it back but in the african context uh -huh, if we get rid of the, the well documented evidences we don't have enough data ourselves that women are powerful leaders and agents for change which in for me i know that that is true but uh, to compromise we get rid of that but we, we all agree that women's leadership in countless disaster situations has directly contributed to the survival of their communities. Yes. That one we all agree. Yes. We don't doubt. So supposing we take the last part, the last point, and we, in our, in our context, we delete the first point of being leaders. 
The powerful leaders. No, no, no. Yes, so I think I we are. We are disagreeing with the fact that yeah. women are powerful the leaders. agents of change and leaders. We have African leaders, women leaders. We have uh, Ellen Johnson, and we have other people occupying positions of leadership in the different countries. Then we leave it as it is. Because of that, we need to Then we leave it as it is. Otherwise, we are going to talk about the fact. This one is a fact. Yes. It was you, yeah. Maybe we could just maybe we could just move the entire paragraph to the end of this preamble, so that we first um, see all the effects that climate change has on women, and then we know um, what other role they are playing. Okay. So we suspend this paragraph. We we'll leave it in hand. We will revisit it. We'll revisit. Let's we'll look. Look. Yes, let's, let's it take it. No, let's go to the second. <laughs> if we put the word can, then no. We're, we're, no, we're, I think what she is suggesting is that we take it from where the position. Yeah. And no. bring it down. No. No, we leave uh, it out first. Oh, we can't leave it out because we can't leave it out. Where can it? Because we are taking forever here. We yes. have to move it. No, I said let's use the word can. Because when we use the word can, that means that everybody is aware of what we, what women can do. It has been documented. Madam, no, let's leave that. The documentation is a problem. Can you say can? It will water us down. It will water us what women are doing. They are already doing it. And the evidence that there is, that women are powerful agents of change. And that's a fact. Yes. So really, I don't see us moving that beyond uh, what here. It will definitely be, be, be rejected. And we know that even in the African context, women are powerful agents of change. Yes. And there is documentary evidence about yes. that. So yes. we cannot say that we say can. If you say can, you are watering it down. Oh. It's, it's not that they can, but that they are. But That's the point. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So Rachel asked, and then we, we yes. Yeah. I'm just thinking aloud. Um, I don't know whether we will move the, the, the disaster, the word disaster, because we all are aware that when disaster strikes, women are the most vulnerable. So instead of adding, putting the disaster, we countless situations. Then we can generalize to the just the opening. Countless situations and leave out the uh, disaster. Because in disaster situations, the women are the most vulnerable. Yeah. And also, we, instead of survival, we, we can climate change the disaster. Can we leave this paragraph for the time being and discuss it? Yes, we will finish. Okay, let's go on. Because we are stuck here. Mm -hmm. Rich, you are the one who brought this. I want you to finish this discussion because I even read in the other place. You know, I think many of us were in the other place where we were going through this. And what I had suggested is that because this document, many it has so many gaps on the issue of Africa.